I'm looking for Janet Green. Have I come to the right place? She's not in. But she does live here. Who wants to know? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't introduce myself. I'm Liza Colby. And you are? Pierce, Riley. Pierce. May I? Sure. What can I do for you, Miss Colby? Did you do this? It's lovely. Look, if you have business with Janet, I'll tell her that you Well, actually, fine. I'm hoping to have business with Janet. I'm the station manager at WRCW. I can see you're not really into television. No, I've got no use for it. Well, luckily for me, most of America can't get enough. I'm here to offer Janet an opportunity of a lifetime. To tell her story to the entire world, at least our little corner of it. And what story is that? A woman struggling to regain her life. Her debt to society has been paid. She's trying to clear her name. We're not interested. Well, if you just give me a little bit of time to tell you what Don't I Don't you understand talked. English? I said no. I think you underestimate the power of television. This could change Janet Green's entire life. <sighs> Janet likes her life just the way it is. Oh, really? With skeletons jumping out of every closet? What about the Janet Green that the press ignored? What about the tortured soul beneath the evil deeds, the loving mother driven to desperate means? She could garner the sympathy of the entire town. And what if she doesn't? Well, then her life stays exactly the way it is. But from what I've read, Will Cortland was an abusive manipulator, a self-confessed rapist. There's a lot of people who would give her an award just for killing the man. Imagine Janet Green being able to hold her head up high in Pine Valley instead of, I don't know, living like Ellie Mae before Pa hit the bubbling crude. We like it here, Miss Colby. Really? Does Janet Green like it here? Miles from her daughter in the middle of nowhere? With WRCW's help, Janet Green may regain custody of her daughter. Isn't that her dream? Look, filling Janet's head full of visions of getting Amanda back is extremely crippling to her. Not if it works. Forget it. You're wasting your time. Maybe she's not. I'd like to hear more. I think I'd like to do the show. You really think it could change people's minds? Has silence improved your situation? She's found peace here, okay? But all Amanda will know is the horrible things that people say about me. That's a cruel legacy for any child. I want to try to make people understand for Amanda's sake. I think that's a wise choice. How about if I get back to you with a time and a date? I'll be ready. Okay, well, it could be tomorrow or even the day after. I'll have to check with production. And it was really great talking to you. To both of you. Thank you, Miss Colby. Oh, you are welcome. <laughs> You're doing the right thing. I really admire your courage. I can't believe you'd go through with this. But I have to, Pierce. I don't like it. I, if you ask me, I think you're making a big mistake. So you have to remind me of this day come bonus time. Another coup? The biggest coup in local television history, Wade. She says modestly. <laughs> Janet Green, live on the cutting edge. Her deep, dark world explored and dissected for our spellbound audience. I walk into the twisted mind of Pine Valley's most favorite murderess. I gotta hand it to you, Liza. Brilliant. Well, you know, her early controversial prison release was gonna have that audience screaming for justice. We're gonna have to upgrade the switchboard. The new owner will love it. What do you mean, just like that? Yeah, hostile takeover. I didn't have enough controlling shares. Well, who, what, a person, a corporation? Rumor has it, a local power broker. That's all I know. Believable. 
Lieutenant Green's murderous mind served up on a silver platter. Should impress the new boss. But wait, our momentum, it's being stalled by new ownership. Momentum? Now wake up, smell the Nielsen's. If you don't get Erica Kane back on the cutting edge, that shows history. Erica, you are so beautiful. I, uh, I better get that. What on earth are you doing here? Hello, Erica. Liza. I want to talk business. 